Thanks for coming back to PokerNews.com. It is our 888 winner spotlight. Congratulations. Thank you. Yeah, of course. You just took down the 1500 bounty no limit hold'em event. You came in, I believe, day three as second in chips, then the second day of the final table, chip leader, and then when you were heads up, you went back and forth. Tell me a little bit about the back and forth today. Well, the back and forth started yesterday. Um, I got moved to the left of um, what was it, Rano. Rano Sutla. Rano Sutla. I got moved to, the, to his left, and we were the two chip leaders, and we immediately started battling, and he got the best of me for a while. Um, I went from having piles of chips to being the shortest stack. I was 13 of 13 uh, within one orbit. I was chip leader again. Um, we both sucked down on each other multiple times. Um, a lot of bluffing going on, a lot of, like, just great battling. He was, like, such a tough player. It was a lot of fun. Um, and then, you know, I didn't expect anything different uh, when we got here forehanded at the final table. He played amazing. Uh, I think I ran really well. Um, and that last hand was just such a stick cooler for him. So. so what do you think was you were 13 of 13? What was the hand that turned it around for you? Um, well, it was actually, it was a, it was a couple of hands. Um, first, I, I limped small blind with ace-king against uh, an aggressive uh, Russian player uh, in the big blind, and he shoved ace-10 off. I snapped him off and, and held, and then um, I got in queen-jack of diamonds on a jack-8-6, two clubs, one diamond, against Rano's king-jack. He had the king of clubs. Turn was a queen of clubs, so we make two pair. He still has a flush draw, rivers a brick, and uh, that was the one really big suck out that I had on him that uh, boosted me up to probably third or fourth in chips, and then the very next hand I busted a, another player, winning a flip. So it went. I went from eight bigs to almost 100 bigs in just uh, like one orbit. We need those suck outs to win tournaments. You just Absolutely. you gotta get lucky too. Yep. And uh, Ryan, your family is here with you. Tell me about who's on your rail. Uh, my mom, my girlfriend, her mom, all my friends were here. Uh, it's amazing having them here. It makes this so special. Um, yeah, I love them all. Thanks for being here, guys. Could you hear when uh, Chance was sort of a uh, yell? Chance Corneth was on the uh, rail, sort of yelling and needling the other opponents at the final yes, table. Absolutely, and uh, I mean, Chance is a must on your rail. He's, <laughs> he's funny. He's, he'll make you laugh, and uh, and he'll needle the uh, your opponent pretty well too. Yeah, he was great. Yeah. Do you have any uh, celebration plans? Uh, no, I'm going to hop in the 5K6 Max. <laughs> so just, you know, the summer's not over. Still a lot of work to do. A lot of big tournaments coming up. So jumping in the 5K6 Max. And, uh, well, I got, a, I got a buddy at the PLO8 final table. I'm going to sweat him. We talked last night. We said we're going to go bracelet, bracelet. So uh, I'm going to sweat him. And then once uh, his tournament ends, I'm going to hop in the 5K6 Max and make a deep run. Well, it's that kind of discipline that wins poker tournaments. Yep. So congratulations, Ryan Lang, your new WSOP bracelet winner.